Ain't there something? Some people can dish it out, but they can't take it. And that's what I can say uh, about the uh, majority of human beings. They can dish it out real, real well. Okay, but when you start checking them and start holding them accountable for their words, they and especially if it's a guy, he's going to either try to bully you, overpower you with your strength, especially when you tell him the truth about himself, um, about what you think is the problem. I don't care how respectfully you do it. If it's hitting them nerves that he can't counteract, and he got some bitch in him. Oops. <laughs> well, he don't even have to have any in him. If he can't maintain and control his emotions very well, what happens is he uses the tactics that he uses in his home, in his household. You get a pretty good glimpse of how a person orchestrates their family when you watch them uh, from, I guess especially when they want to do comedy. And you want to know where this is coming from? Yes, it certainly is. It's coming from T.I. Tip going on stage and attacking the female comedian. Because that's exactly what it was. It was comedy, and what he did was go on stage and attack a woman because he did not like how what the way her act was going. He didn't like the way her act was, what she was talking about. In fact, she never said anything about him until he didn't shut up. Okay, and she said something to the fact. Actually, I watched her interview on uh, a shout out to Tasha K. Uh, I watched her interview, the young lady's interview on Unwind with Tasha K. And I'm sure y'all all know who she is. The fact of the matter is, the the explanation that she gave verified and it backed up exactly what um, she said. Also, T.I. owes her a million dollars because he's standing in the back of the club calling a woman a bitch. Bitch. From, this is from her act now. Now, we just had an incident where Will Smith went up on stage and slapped um, Chris Rock, right? We just dealt with this. So what I'm seeing is black people are out of control emotionally. And what's going to happen is, see, y'all y'all, y'all want to handle everything like it's the source of war. Y'all want to handle everything like the first instinct that you have is to go up and attack somebody. And this is what I'm seeing from black people. I can't blame white people for this. This is our conditioning. Okay? Because they ain't doing it to us now. This is what we're doing to ourselves. We got no respect for the women comics. This dude, I was so angry. I mean, and then the men that were sitting around letting him do that, big old robust, fat, big, giant, uh, bodybuilding type of dudes, let T.I. little ass come up there and do whatever the hell he wanted to do. Why? Y'all, that's scary, and that's what I mean. You're a bunch of punks. That woman up there had more balls and testicular fortitude than any of y'all that was standing up at that stage, allowing T.I. to disrespect her, allow him to go around, take her mic, and then grab her real, uh, uh, put her in a bear hug like we friends like that. Oh, my God. The whole thing, re it was abusive. The whole scene was abusive. And actually, if that's what Tiny put up with at the house, y'all talking about Jada. Y'all got the nerve to talk about Jada and being a narcissist. Look at Tip and what he did. And until you got some smoke for Tip and what he did, you need to shut the hell up and back up off of Jada. Because um, what he did just showed me that he don't give a damn about nobody. He's already jumped in and uh, think he's 
the top comedian, okay, and I know he's got a name, T.I., so that's going to allow him to uh, catapult over a lot of other artists, even though he's not ready. But to further let me know he's not ready, um, dude, that's what comedy is all about, okay? What Chris Rock said, he didn't say, Jada, you bald head bitch. He said, wow, I heard G.I. Jane 2 is coming out, okay? And Will smelt, felt that was enough to turn the Oscars into the Source Award, okay? Here this young lady is doing her club uh, uh, thing, which she stated out of her own mouth. That's her night to do that. She's met Tip before. He's been there before. But this is her night to do that. So he want to get there, disrespect her, take her mic. Oh, my God. Then sit on the stage. And none of those men did a damn thing. Oh, God. None of those men did a damn thing. Just like when you ask who was the uh, first starters of the uh, Rodney King riot, or when you want to know who set stuff off, it don't be the men. Because we give birth to the men and the women. So when something jump off, it's usually the women. And you know what? Y'all really some sad uh, sacks of shit to allow that to happen. That's what I want to say. And all those guys that was there letting Tip abuse her physically and verbally didn't say, man, you need to go off the stage, man. This is her time because you're scared. Uh, you punks. You didn't want to say nothing to him and you let that man disrespect that girl set like that. I said it, and I mean it. It was the most disrespectful thing I've seen, and I'm surprised that Tip. He got the nerve to talk talk to Godfrey and them talking about not getting his chance and how he think they line up here. Dude, you don't need to be doing comedy. You this ain't no damn where you don't get your way like you do at home. You start uh, beating people up when you don't get your way. This ain't what that is. This is not. With that being said, um, I want to know how somebody else feels. Because I was very insulted by the whole thing. In fact, I got angry watching it. Because nobody should be subjected to that while they're trying to perform. Nobody. Not even Tip. And quiet as it's kept, he wouldn't be subject uh, uh, subjected to that kind of treatment of him if he was trying to perform. So I want to know how y'all feel. Is it just me? Is it just me? Okay. If you like what you hear, subscribe and share the channel. Uh, hit the like button. Um, it's so you and hit the bell. So when I do drop another video, you can be notified, and I don't have to worry about keep going with the algorithms. Um. Uh, that, that video was so disturbing. Anyway, I'll see you in the next.